This is a guide on replacing the front assembly on the Apple iPhone X. For the installation process, we'll need the following tools. A heat gun, a plastic pick, tweezers, a suction cup, a small tri-wing screwdriver, a small flat screwdriver, and a small Phillips screwdriver. The front assembly consists of the frame, the glass digitizer, and the LCD screen. You will need to replace the entire front assembly if any of these components are broken. Turn the phone off by holding the power and the up volume buttons and confirm the shutdown on screen. Remove two pentalobe screws at the bottom of the phone. Use a heat gun to warm up the adhesive around the perimeter of the iPhone. Place a suction cup near the bottom edge, and while providing some tension, insert a plastic peg between the display assembly and the main body. Gently move the plastic peg around the perimeter, separating the display assembly from the main body. Please note, there are cables located near the right edge of the phone, and there are hooks at the top edge holding the display assembly. Keeping that in mind, unlatch the top edge and open the phone to the right side. Now we have access to the connector shield. Using a tri-wing screwdriver, carefully remove five screws securing the large shield. Remove the shield. Using a plastic pick, Open the battery connector and bend the lead away. Next, pick open the front speaker and sensor connector, the touch digitizer connector, and the LCD connector. Separate the screen assembly from the main body. We will be replacing the waterproofing adhesive, so all of the original adhesive needs to be removed from the edge of the phone. Use a plastic pick to clean out the adhesive. The replacement display assembly does not contain the front speaker and sensors. We will be transferring them from the original display. Remove three tri-wing screws and unfold the speaker. Using a plastic pick, carefully pick out the sensors from its placement and separate the entire garland from the display. Take out the new assembly and place the sensors in their appropriate locations. Fold over the speaker and replace the three tri-wing screws. The waterproofing adhesive comes on convenient plastic sheets cut to the shape of the edge of the foam. Remove the backing plastic of the adhesive shape. Apply the shape to the perimeter of the phone and press the adhesive into place. Carefully begin removing the plastic, making sure that the adhesive stays on the perimeter of the phone. Put the new display assembly to the right edge of the phone and reconnect the touch digitizer connector the LCD connector, then the front speaker and sensors connector. Carefully reconnect the battery connector. At this point, the new display can be tested. Put the display down and press the power button. The startup graphics appears, and we can shut down the phone. Replace the large connector shield and secure it with five tri-wing screws. To properly close the display, keep the position of the top edge latches in mind and start by latching the top edge. Then firmly press around the perimeter of the phone, snapping the display assembly in place. Replace the two pentalobe screws near the lightning connector. Turn the phone on 
and we're done.